what's up fam it's me just again so today i wanted to do a q a kind of just to get to know me a little bit more as a new youtuber i feel that it would probably be a good thing people probably don't want to know who the fuck i am so i had a, a bunch of chores i'm supposed to be doing so i'm making a video instead well i'm still gonna do the chores look i brought laundry to fold so we can do that too because there's an abundance of fucking laundry all the time and sorry my background's not very fancy it's my bedroom it's not fancy not a fancy person as you can tell but uh yeah so i made a list of things but uh before we get started before we get started don't forget to subscribe hit that bell and uh, if you like this video uh leave a thumbs up and i can make more q a videos of like more in depth about the questions that I've answered here or just about other questions that you maybe want to get my opinion on and my glasses are dirty as fuck but yeah and we'll see and hopefully you guys enjoy this amazing freaking video of uh, me just you know being answering questions and uh, I didn't wash my hair but I use this I've never used this before but it's a, a dry shampoo because I'm not fancy so I don't get to buy these things often but it's invisible dry shampoo and uh seems it feels nice i don't know it's this brand here i'm not sponsored by it at all but uh i got it at that sally's place where i got this hair dye i got a bunch of stuff in there and i put it in today and it feels nice it feels like it sucked up that shit but okay so i guess the first question would be, how old am I? Well, I'm almost a, what, quarter of a century year old? So almost 25. I'm turning 25 in November on the 7th. <laughs> Party time. I'm hoping that it's going to be a, a decent get-together. But I'm a mom, and I have three kids, so it's... I don't get out very often. I don't get to do things that often. Oh, hey! Hey! <laughs> Uh, next question would be, do I have children? And I just answer that. I do. I have three children. I have a daughter that's turning nine in December. And I have a son that just turned seven in May. And I had a baby about like six months ago. Six months ago now, just passed. Uh, and her name is Isabella. So, yeah. Mama, three here. I know the struggles. Mama's come and talk to me about your struggles, I know. Uh, well, favorite color and why? Um, pink is definitely a favorite color because it makes me feel very confident when I wear it. I love all shades of pink. It doesn't even matter the shade of pink. It's just so, so pretty. So, and it just makes me feel confident. It's like a confident, pretty color. And then green is my other favorite color because green is like the color of life. Like trees, grass, everything like that is green. Everything good is green. So, yeah, green would have to be definitely one of my favorite colors. Sorry, it's my bra. Hold my bra. That's not a flattering face. Don't use that as my thumbnail. Please, YouTube. Uh... And then I would have to say, uh, okay, next question, my religion. Uh, well, I'm very open to everybody's religion. I find the good in most religions, and that's part of my religion in itself. I'm a pagan. And if you want to know what that is, you can Google it. Or I can, I'm actually thinking about doing a whole video on my paganism because in that, this religion everybody's so different they their the craft the way they do their rituals and everything like that is so different we more, more or less have a base but it's a good thing it's a good independent religion i think i don't know as a word to call it i guess but i'm i can make a video a little bit more in depth about that uh am i dating i am I have a boyfriend. His name is Morgan. You've seen him probably in a couple of my videos or heard him. But uh, he's great. He's awesome. 
he's a little bit older than I am. He's great with my kids. He's not their dad. But he does everything with them, and he's so great with them, and they just love him to death. And we've been dating for five months now, so he's basically in, been here since Izzy's been born. Izzy's my, Isabella's my youngest. And, yeah, he's super great. So, I'm dating him. <laughs> and next question. Number six. Ooh, favorite hobbies. See, this is such a hard one because I like to do so much. Like, for for me, YouTube right now is a hobby. Like, I would love it to be a career one day. I'd love it to be everything. But right now, it's just a hobby. It's something I enjoy doing. And then painting is another great hobby. I love reading. I love making things. Like, I like taking apart palettes and building little things out of them. I built Morgan a beard shelf, which I'll put in one of my videos. Maybe I'll sh show people how to make a it's like a beard accessory shelf for the bathroom and it's all stained and nice it's really pretty and uh, I like refurbishing furniture that's always fun too and I like to learn a lot like another thing a part of my religion is it's very knowledge based it's always learning you're always learning and learning and learning and I'm big on that I always love to learn new things like I never finished high school so when I went back to school as an adult I noticed I focused a lot more and I, I was actually interested in what I was learning. I was happy to be learning. I wasn't worried about my friends and all this kind of stuff and popularity or what's going on there. Who's doing this after school? I focused. And I was really happy to learn. And now even still, I'm still like that. So I don't know. I just like learning things. I like conspiracy theories. I love watching other people's YouTube videos. It's great. Um, why did I start YouTube? Well, pretty much why everybody starts YouTube, I think. It's just like a creative outlet where you can just be yourself, I guess, and, and doesn't really, mm, I guess it matters, but I don't know. I want to, and I want to inspire people too. Like I've gone through a lot of stuff in my life that some people may have relate to or, you know, and I'm not the most knowledgeable person in every aspect in life but I could possibly give some helpful hit, tips and hints and advice to for certain things I don't know I'm, I'm trying to be inspirational I'm gonna help y'all I was a single mother for a long time I grew up with a rough childhood I have gone through so much like I can do story times about so many things and you'll be like wow she fucked up that's why she fucked up but yeah uh what message are you trying to send with my channel well basically you could just be yourself and do what you want to do and sh and she will happen like sorry I don't I don't know what's the best way to come up with it I'm not too keen with words right on the spot like this because I'm not editing this video my videos aren't edited the, 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 aren't edited at the moment uh, until I get my program up and running but I just really want to let people know that you know struggles are struggles and people can get through it like I've been abused. I've been in abusive relationships. I've lived in a shelter with my children before. I've overcome that. I've overcome housing issues. I, you know, like uh, financial issues. I've learned to budget. Uh, all sorts of stuff. Because I was a young mom. I was a very young mom. I was my first child I had when I was 16. And then 17. And then just recently. So over that time, I learned a lot about how to be an adult, basically. I, I think I learned anyway. So if I could give anybody any kind of helpful advice on anything, then definitely would be something that I'd want to do. And just to let people know that life gets better, you know, like I was struggled too, and it was hard and life still is hard sometimes, but we can get through this together. I'll be here to help support you. Just like you guys are here to support me. Right. That's, that's the thing. Whoa. Did you see that thing floating around in the screen? Ghost. <gasps> Ghosts! Ghost channel. Anyway. Uh, 
what is my top three male slash female YouTubers? Top three. Oh, that's so hard. Okay. My very favorite, I'd have to say. Sorry, everybody else is so great. There's so many great creators out there. It's so hard to just pick. But I'd have to say the ones I watch more often, the ones I'm excited and waiting to watch for, would have to be Shane Dawson. He's amazing. He's so funny and just inspirational and real. And I think we'd really get along. I think we'd be awesome friends. Just saying. Just saying. Just saying. And for a female would be Jenna Marbles, I think, because she's fucking hilarious. And I think me and her have the same kind of comedy style. And I don't know. We'd, we'd have fun. I know we'd have fun. We'd be besties. We'd be besties. Faux show. Faux show, fam. Faux show. Um... And the, there's just so many. I don't know. I'm not going to pick my top. I'm just going to pick my top ones because those are the ones that are my favorite. Because there's so I could just. Stop. So... <laughs> what are a couple life goals I have? A couple life goals I have probably would be to be. I'm still not finished my, my uh, schooling that I would like to do. I'd like to finish that eventually. Um, I'd love to have uh, my YouTube channel flourish and be able to create a community on here with you guys and have some place where I can come and just express myself and you guys enjoy it. Um, I'd also like to open up my own business within the next few years. I have, uh, I'm drawing up a business plan and that's something I could talk to you about in another video. I think it's interesting. I don't know. Something based along the lines of my pagan religion, but not so much, but kind of, sort of. Uh, and then I would like to own a home, of course. Anybody would like to own a home. I would love to own a home, my own place, for my family to, to be able to pass down through generation, through generation to my family. And I think that'd be a very responsible thing to do I don't know those are a few goals I have there's always they're always changing there's always more added you, you know oh I love this dress this dress is just so gorgeous I should like do a like a closet tour but it's a blue dress and it's kind of like a little bunched up here but it's like right under the boob and then it's open here it opens in the front and it's short blue underneath and then long flowy all the way to the back so pretty, so amazing. Oh, I haven't worn it with my pink hair yet. Oh my god. <laughs> this has to be hanged up. Uh, do I have pets? Of course I have pets. I love animals. We have some fish here. Uh, we have Jack the cat. He's a big old cranky cat, but he's my love. I love him. And you guys have seen him in videos. And I have Dino, or Beans, or Beano, or Bean Bean, Beanerson of Beanerson Incorporated. So all his names kind of rolled into one. He's my Chihuahua. You'll also see him. You've probably seen him in the last video, but you'll see him in a lot of videos too because he's not camera shy, that dog. Not. Uh, have I ever traveled? Inside of Canada, I've been to Manitoba, which is where I live now. Saskatchewan, Alberta, BC, which was where I was born. And then... That's about it. I've never traveled outside of Canada. I have no life. I live nowhere. <laughs> this is my life. Laundry. All day. Every day. Laundry. Uh, what, uh, what are my favorite kinds of food? Well, everything. All of it. All the food. As usual. So there's that. <clears throat> Am I superstitious? Yes, being a pagan, it kind of comes with the territory. I'm very superstitious. I believe in spirits and energies and auras and all that kind of stuff, which I can touch bases on in other videos just to maybe inform you guys a little bit more detailed on what that is. You could also just go Google it yourself, but if you want me to explain it in how, I guess, my terms and Sure, I can do that. 
Uh, and where do I see myself in five years? Well, like I said, in a home, hopefully, with my business slowly growing, with a healthy YouTube channel that I can come and just chill out with my fam, my, com my YouTube fam, little community. And that's about it. So there you go. That's 15 things that you didn't know about me that you now know about me that you maybe didn't care about knowing about me. But now you know anyway. So if you even watch this full video, thanks, guys. I freaking love you. Thanks for supporting me. And if you want to see more, don't forget to hit that like button down there and subscribe. And hopefully I'll get more of this laundry done instead of just chatting away. Because sorry, I'm just chatting away. But, oh fuck, it's not sponsored though, by the way. Mm. But fucking good. And yeah, so if you have any questions for me though, or if you want me to do a different kind of Q&A, or if you just want me to never do a Q&A again, then let me know. Because, really, I want to know how you feel about this shit. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Well, I love you and have a good day. See you later, fam. Bye.